All right, buddy, what are we doing? Uh, I think we're going to go look at a dark horse. <laughs> so, yeah, surprise. I haven't told anybody this on the channel yet at all. Uh, we are taking delivery of my uh, 2024 uh, dark horse. You heard that correctly. <laughs> so that's going to be the latest car on the channel. I have never seen one in person. This will be the first time. So welcome back, and I hope you guys are having a great day as always. And here's the wife. Hi. Nick, you want to say hi? Hi. Let's yep. do this. Oh, it's right here. Oh, it's not. I know. Oh, man, this is beautiful. So this is my first impressions um, of seeing this car. Oh man, she looks good, bro. It's gorgeous. Yeah. It's a nice spec, brother. Yeah, it looks good. Check this out. So the radiator guards, do you think it's gonna need it? Or no? I don't know anything about these. I don't think so. I think it'd be all right. Man, this car looks really good in person. Oh, it's beautiful. So this is the latest car for the channel. So, as always, I can't thank uh, Whitmore enough. Um, hey, keep in mind, you're mic'd up. <laughs> yeah, can't be too crazy. Huh? Can't say anything too crazy. Nah. Just let Nick know his mic. Hey, Matt, you want to say hi? What's up? If you guys are still looking for a ZR1, man, it's still there, right? Yeah. Want to talk about it? Yeah. 19, 2800 miles. Oh, my God. So yeah, we are, we're gonna take delivery of this car um, and then with uh, Matt and Nick and everybody here, we will be sourcing another one, hopefully very soon. I'm not gonna tell you what that is, because to be honest with you, I don't know for sure what it is. I didn't even know I was buying this until this past week. <laughs> and that is not a lie. I know a lot of people on YouTube, this whole clickbait thing, but I'm telling you right now, that is the honest to God truth. So luckily, luckily uh, working with Matt and everybody, it's, just, it's so easy. Um, you are. But I'm very grateful. You bet. Say the least. So this is the new Dark Horse, guys. We will, uh, like all the rest of the cars on the channel, we will be uh, we'll be providing you guys with the full experience of what this is like. But yeah. take a look at this exhaust. Jesus, exhaust on this thing is huge compared to, uh, you know, with the C8. Oh my God, the tips! I can't wait to hear this thing. Can't wait to drive it for the first time. You like it? Dark horse. I didn't see that. And Matt, did you see the um, wow. emblem in the back of the vehicle? No. So the emblems are off because this car is going to be getting PPF uh, very soon. So, and I want you guys to guess, but looking at this car, what would be your first mod to this car? Because believe it or not, I've already ordered my first mod for this car. Now it'll be on a later upload. But uh, I'm already buying mods for it. I haven't even picked it up yet. <laughs> ah, well, this is gonna be hard. This could be hard to keep this stock, man. Cause it's so easy to modify. Oh yeah. Oh my God. That's. I mean, comparative to other cars, it's just price points and right on the money. Take a look at the brakes. Good God, they're huge. So guys, what do you think about the dark horse? I believe these are the brakes from the GT500. Um, what's your first impressions? Look at the cap. The cap is right there. It's not, they're not sunk in too much. I really thought they are going to be sunk in more than, than what I thought. And they sit tucked in a lot better than I thought, too. Nice. Absolutely beautiful. Hey, this is our car. So we got... Alcatara or suede as some would say and uh, this does have the back seats oh this is this is beautiful wow this is so much better in person I love these seats I love everything about this so it's hard to tell but <laughs> there's actually a blue um, hint to these seats as well as the blue stitching it's got blue lighting, huh? It's got blue lighting inside the door seals, down by the pedals. 
And this is the 10R uh, transmission. This is not the uh, six-speed. So six-speed or automatic, what will you guys have chose? Um, and this is that MSRP. I know there's a lot of discussions on the internet about dealerships charging over this and that. I stated it in my other uploads as far as the C8s. They've always been MSRP at new, uh, new. So just to make that clear as a bell, because I've seen some of the comments, people are like, now they're giving discounts on the C8s, you know, after charging more MSRP, never the case. So if you're interested in a C8, they do have a couple available with some amazing freaking discounts. And I highly recommend you check them out. I'll put some of that information right here, right now, as I'm talking. And uh, of course, that beautiful C701 is still there. But again, MSRP. So by the sound of that, we are the official new owners of the 2024 Dark Horse. Uh, man, that sounds good. So what did you think of that first startup? Now, I don't know. Uh, man, that's beautiful. Well, that is the uh, first impressions of the motor. First time we're seeing it here at the dealership. And um, that just looks amazing. I mean, so easy to modify. Oh, my God. Just right, reach right on in and put a turbo in turbo, you know. Let's call it a day, bro. Wow. Okay. Wow, I don't even know. I'm a little speechless, guys. Let me know what you think. I think it looks glorious. We'll go over this at another point in time. But here for delivery, here we go. This is beautiful. One of ten, right? No, this I'm going to put on a brand new trailer. No, I'm saying it's one of ten. Yeah, one of ten in the world. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So this is going to be on bring a trailer. This is one of ten. Let me repeat that. One of ten. And what, what anniversary is this? 40th anniversary. 40th anniversary. They only make them like this. The only option was silver wheels or dark gray wheels, which I didn't like. One of ten. Yeah. I want to mark this in my history book because we'll mm -hmm. probably never see one of these never again. Again. So if we're going to put it on bring a trailer next week, uh, hopefully it goes to the moon. It's going to go to the moon, dude. It's going to go to the moon. But, I mean, special leather. It's got the tonneau cover with the carbon fiber roll bar. Look at this tonneau cover, dude. Yeah, it's cool. With, oh, my God, that's sick. Yeah. That is sick. So it still has the rear seats. This is just a, a tonneau cover that's strapped in through the seat belts and through uh, like hooks that go around the back of it. Oh my it's God. Pretty cool. So you can still take the top off and use the soft top if yeah. you want to, but nobody's ever going to do that. So how did this happen? I mean, I guess like the combination of the new, yeah, so, the new ownership, right? Well, no. Um, obviously, we're a Celine dealer, and Celine reached out and said, oh, hey, that's right. the anniversary cars are coming up. You guys qualify to get one. Right. So do you want it? I said, yeah, we want it immediately. We sent out, it was actually an Atlas Blue. Uh, premium manual we had so I sent that to them and they did this this is insane but they're all dude. the same yeah again the only option is it, depending on what if you had an automatic or manual to send them right you could send them this wasn't a manual and the only option you could actually pick was the wheels so let me uh and this truck carbon too. fiber carbon fiber fenders fiberglass hood insane carbon fiber front bumper lip Frank I was just talking carbon, to you about this carbon fiber side splitters rear diffusers all carbon yeah, I'll get some more footage of this. Right? This is insane. Like, this is a, a moment to remember because you know, I'm never going to see one again. Yeah, they'll end up in a collection somewhere. Yeah, it should be. Absolutely should be. So this is the uh, number eight, it looks like, of, uh, out of Fun ten. Fact is, this is the second one off the line, but it's number eight. Wow. They don't, do, they don't do them in order. They just say, this is the build. Oh, wow. And that's what it is, yeah. That is an interesting... And they uh, never build a number seven. 
Here's the uh, spec sheet again. So there will be card number one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven. No number sevens ever. That's yeah. sick, dude. So for you Mustang guys, I guess it's like, guess it's like an unlucky number for them. Um, never a number seven. This is the holy grail of the uh, Celines. Yeah. And uh, bring a trailer. When is it going on? Uh, in two, three weeks. All right, two or three weeks. You guys keep a close eye on bring a trailer. And uh, Frank, if you're listening, you might want to bid on this. Um, I know you like your little teeny, uh, what's that thing called in my garage? What is it, a super? It's a beautiful Oh, it's a Viper. Viper. It's a Viper. <laughs> yeah. No, his Viper is his, his, his gorgeous, guys. So I want to thank Matt for uh, you know, giving us that information on this car. But you heard it here first, one of ten, and it will be on Bring a Trailer in a couple of weeks. So we're going to fill out some paperwork for this dark horse. Babe, you want to say anything? I know, right? This, you love it? Guys, what do you think about this Celine too? So this is a Celine edition truck. I think it makes 700 plus horsepower. I think the MSRP, and this is at retail, is like 105. She wants it bad. Look at the color. Uh, maybe we'll, well, maybe this is the option. I thought you didn't want another truck. Here we go, guys. Here we go. You really like this, huh? Oh, it's blue. Did you realize this is blue? Yeah, that's the first thing I saw. Yeah. So let, let's look at the sticker on this, guys. So this is another uh, yellow badge, possibly. Celine truck. Uh, I get 700 plus. I'm assuming it's going to be pretty rare. And again, here, Whitmore. And this is at MSRP. Yep. Yellow, uh, yellow label is what this is. So 103233. And if you guys are interested in this truck, which is absolutely beautiful. Oh, it is gorgeous. It is gorgeous. She wants this truck now. This is what we were talking about, right? When did the one you sent me pictures of a little while ago about? So much better in person, dude. I don't know if I would want to. Is it unlocked? Is it unlocked? Yeah, it should be. I think so. Guys, I'm supposed to be here for my dark horse. What am I doing? All oh, the stitching. I know. Oh, this is Pretty beautiful, bro. White and blue all in one. This is freaking beautiful. I know. <laughs> the wife wants to hop in. Look, it's my son. Hey, look, this is Nick's day off, so he's not even supposed to be here. So, <laughs> I live he, here basically. It's my second home. So, thank, thank you so much as usual, bro. Anytime, bro. We, don't, we don't need to test drive this, dude. We'll be fine. Yeah, we'll be fine. I'm good. Uh, okay. Well, we got some decisions to make, guys. We really do. So, like I said, in the, in the near future, I'm going to make some serious decisions. We are going to keep the Dark Horse. We decided that. I know I'm saying that and I'm just now buying it, but we are going to keep that and add something else to the house. Don't know what it's going to be. This is an option. Absolutely. Um, I, I, I pre, pre owned uh, Z06. Ooh, I got paperwork. Okay, I gotta go, guys.